morning children hope you are all doing good and safe welcome back to third standard english class block 8 learning through fables our today's topic is retell a story retell a story so today we are going to retell the story the lion and the mouse before that let me ask you how many of you have read a comic children how is the story in a comic look different from the story in your english reader or in any story book in a comic there are lots of pictures which help us guess what the characters are must be talking about and also the sentences are short and we include only the main events of the story like that the comic stories will be there children uh, do you remember the story the blue kite children which we have read now i will show you the comic strip of the story the blue kite so this is the comic strip of the story the blue kite okay see here the blue kite is there see here hi hi and they you know the kites in china have such bright colors we can see them from far away we can see the blue kite's face children it is very sad so by seeing the pictures also we can understand okay then i must go there then the kite is telling to itself her itself yeah, i must go there then it met an owl hey owl where is china then the owl is telling that it is very far you should cross the sea of gray whales okay thank you oh i reach china the kites are really amazing see here there are different types of kites in china you look so beautiful the different kites you know they were telling that blue kite you so you look so beautiful then the kites felt very happy hooray i am also beautiful see so this is the story here what i did i just made the comic strip now we'll see the story in the english reader so this is the story the blue kite children in our english reader english in our english reader if you observe that they have given this story in detailed manner okay see here what is happening means they included many parts but in comic strip what did i do i just included only the main events of the story so that we can understand the sequence and so that we can understand the story very clearly by seeing the pictures and seeing the sentences which the characters are talking in our comic strip we included pictures of all those events which were important for us to understand the story these pictures were drawn in the right order or sequence so that we know in which order the things happened now let us come to our present story the lion and the mouse what are the four main events of the story children first the mouse jumps on the lion then the lion caught the mouse after that the lion trapped in a net and finally the mouse gnaw the net and freed the lion these are the main events of the story the lion and the mouse so today we are going to make the comic strip of the story the lion and the mouse okay children let me ask you before that before that let me ask you If you were in place of mouse, what you will do? Will you help the lion? No, maybe you might not help the lion because we know that lion is a dangerous animal and also maybe it can harm us. Okay, children. Now we are going to prepare the comic strip of the story Lion and the Mouse in our workbooks. So open your English workbooks. S three, retell a story. Write today's day, children. Twenty eight dash ten dash twenty twenty. See comic strip. Draw four important events from the story. Under each box, write what the characters say to each other. We are not going to write the story. We are not going to write the story, children. We are just going to write the sentences. What the characters are talking. Okay, here. See, they have given you four boxes. They have given you four boxes. In that each box, first you have to draw the pictures. See here. I mentioned the page number. I have mentioned the page numbers. Page number fifty-four. First picture. It is there. Mouse. Where can I find food? Lion growled. Nothing. Okay. Lion growled. Again, I am reading, children. Mouse. Where can I find food? Lion. Rrr, growled. 
See the second picture. Page number 55 it is there children. See the picture and draw. Page number 55. Mouse. Don't eat me. I will help you. Don't eat me. I will help you. And lion. How can a tiny thing like you help me? How can a tiny thing like you help me? Okay now coming to the third one. This is page number 56. First picture you have to draw. Lion. Someone help. Someone free me. Like that it is telling. Then the last picture. Page number 57 it is there. Mouse. Here I come. I will cut the net. Then you will be free again. Again I am reading mouse. Here I come. I will cut the net. Then you will be free again. Here see children. We have made comic strip. Means the pictures and the dialogues. Okay. Complete the workbook. Do it neatly. Thank you.